I really want to do this so badly, but I just can't. I'm going to try it. And if it looks bad, I apologize. Skidoosh. <laughs> Did it work? Oh, I hope so. Kung Fu Panda 3 is the third installment of the Kung Fu Panda franchise. This film has a lot of the returning cast members including Jack Black, Angelina Jolie, Dustin Hoffman, Jackie Chan, Seth Rogen, David Cross, Lucy Liu, and we have new cast members including Brian Cranston, Kate Hudson, and J.K. Simmons. Now this one comes around and Poe becomes the master. He finds out that his father is alive and then he brings him to a whole village of pandas that are still alive. And while all this is going on, this villain cop voiced by J.K. Simmons appears and he wants to destroy all the masters to gain revenge. And there's only one person that can stop him, Poe the Panda. I love the first two Kung Fu Panda films. I adore them to death. And I was really looking forward to Kung Fu Panda 3. Was I let down? No. I was very surprised because this movie was coming out in January. And, you know, January films aren't that great. And yet this film was pretty good. I really, really dug this film. The animation is gorgeous, as always, with these three Kung Fu Panda films. I love the characters. I love the voice casting. The martial arts sequences are fantastic. There's not as many here as there were in the first two this one has more story than action which may throw some people off but for me i was still into it nonetheless because i love the story in this film of how poe tries to bond with his long lost father and then all these other pandas who everyone thought were extinct everyone thought that poe was the last remaining panda ever it's a great story it's a great touching story and i really bought that like i said the animation is gorgeous the voice acting jack black is so good as poe all the Furious Five members are great. Dustin Hoffman's great as Master Shifu. Brian Cranston voicing the panda is like one of the greatest castings in any anime film ever. And I thought he did a really good job in this film. J.K. Simmons was great as cop. Well, first of all, J.K. Simmons is J.K. Simmons. And if you mess with J.K. Simmons, like his characters, he's going to kill you. But if you meet him in person, he actually seems like a very nice person. So yeah, he did a great job as the villain. And I really like the villain's story very very much and the movie was of course very funny like uh, i always go f to these kung fu panda films expecting really good comedy and really good heart and i got a lot of funny moments i laughed a lot during this movie and i just really had a great time seeing it there's one thing i really want to talk about the most like i don't really have any problems necessarily with this movie i will say that's probably my least favorite out of the franchise but i have to say that the way this movie ends is perfect and here's why i'm not going to spoil the ending I'm just going to tell you right now that the movie, the way the movie ends feels like the perfect ending to this whole franchise. Now granted, will they make a fourth one? I have no clue. There's a 50-50 chance we'll get a fourth one. I don't want a fourth one, honestly, because this is the perfect way to end the series. I think the series ran its course. I think three films is good enough. I think all three films were great. And I just love the way the film ends. I think this is a perfect final installment to the series, and I hope it is the last one. Kung Fu Panda 3 was a lot of fun. I had I was engaged. I was laughing. My heart was touched. I had a great time. I had a blast. Go see Kung Fu Panda 3. Bring your kids. Go with the families. And I give it an A-. minus. Guys, tell me down below what you thought of this movie. If you saw it, what's your favorite installment in the Kung Fu Panda series? Thank you guys so much for watching this review. And I'll see you guys soon. <music>